Greetings everyone. Today I'll be cooking, making whatever you like to call it, my favorite food, which is hamburgers. Um, one of them I eat all the time and the other three I don't. So the one I eat all the time, I'll just tell you right now, is the barbecue bacon burger or Texas burger, which I really like. And the other three is a classic burger, which you can just get anywhere. It's just a, a classic burger, hence the name classic burger. And then a um, chipotle garlic burger, which has like chipotle um, peppers. And then finally the Swiss mushroom burger. So um, let's get into it. So my grandma says that you should have 80% lean, 20% fat ground beef, which is this. And before you do this, of course, wash your hands so that, you know, it's edible. Here I've got an egg. I've got sriracha sauce. I've got some heavy whipping cream. I've got salt, pepper, and onion powder. And we're gonna put them all in, so. Gonna mix it all together. Once it's all mixed in and you don't wanna do it too much or else it's gonna become tough, you're ready to make your patties. First one I'm gonna be making is the Texan one, my favorite one. And for that one, we will need bacon. So bacon is pretty easy. You just take the bacon, slap it on it. And we're gonna saute the onions and uh, make the barbecue sauce. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take like a spoonful of butter and you're just gonna come over here to this very light, nice fire here and you're just gonna put the butter on it. Move it around. I'm going to let that sit right directly in the middle. Because I think that's what you're supposed to do. Now I'm gonna take my wooden spoon here I'm gonna take the onions, and I'm just gonna put them on there. There we go. And I'm going to take salt, and pepper, and then I'm just gonna move them around and grill them and make them all nice and tasty. Next, get your favorite barbecue sauce um, and just. Is this completely closed? Oh, yeah, it is. Oh, there we go. You open it up and pour it in there. Now, for the tablespoon of honey. Oh yeah, that's very nice. And we just uh, mix it in. Barbecue sauce. For the second burger is the Swiss mushroom burger. So we're just sauteing these mushrooms and then we're going to put some Swiss cheese in later. Should we, that's it, should be good. So for the Chipotle burger, we're gonna be sauteing these peppers and garlic together. And then we're gonna make a Chipotle sauce and then finish it off with some crushed up avocados. Now I am grilling the peppers and garlic together and we cut the garlic uh, open so that it has more flavor. So now we're going to make the Chipotle sauce with some mayonnaise. Just gonna scoop it all in there. And then we're gonna take our peppers and we're just gonna put them in there as well. Then we're gonna take the garlic press, put some garlic in it and just squeeze them out, put them in, mix it all together. And finally, our classic burger, which has, you know, the basic ingredients, uh, pickles, cheese, 
lettuce, onions, and tomatoes. And then you can probably just put whatever you want on that, ketchup, Dijon mustard, whatever. So for the grilling part, some people like a spatula and some people like tongs, but I learned this cool trick where you can have both at the same time. So now we're going to put the burgers together. Uh, I'm going to start off with the classic burger because it's a classic. So, you know, we'll see. Take a bite out of this. Let's see. Mmm. That's pretty good. That one's really good, actually. All right, next is the Chipotle burger. So we're gonna take a bun. We're gonna get this one there. Okay, burger number two. Hmm. Hmm. Might be better than the first one. I don't know. Pretty good though. I really like those peppers, they, those are good. It's also a little spicier. I can taste it now, that's spicy. Third burger is the Swiss mushroom burger, so we're gonna take Actually, I think I'm gonna melt the cheese on this one, so without the top bun, I'm gonna put it on a plate. Don't put ketchup on it. I've been informed by the pro chefs in the family. So, oh, ah, that's hot. Okay, I'm just gonna. It's hot. <laughs> it's hot. Mm. It's mm. So it tastes great. Probably let it cool down before you bite right into it. That'd be smart. So put that one over there. Now, last but definitely not least, the one I've been waiting for. The Texas burger. You're gonna grab your glorious brioche bun. A magnificently sized patty. sauce with some nice grilled onions in it. Take about a spoonful and slap it right on that patty and mix it in and get another one because everything's bigger in Texas and keep slapping it on and then you want to get your bacon and crack it in multiple pieces and really get it in there as much bacon as you want because everything's bigger in Texas so three pieces of bacon sounds just about right. Slap the patty on, pick it all up, and bite right into it. Mm. Oh. 
That's the best burger right there. I hope you guys enjoyed uh, cooking burgers with me. Um, I, um, I encourage you to go make your own because they taste really good. And um, all the ingredients are I've shown here, so you can just pick it up, make them yourself. See you next time.